Hallelujah. My people of God, good afternoon. Good evening. Depends on the place you have. We bless God Almighty, my blessed people of God, and we thank God Almighty for making us to see this beautiful and this wonderful day in our life in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. God bless you almightily, powerfully in the name of Jesus Christ. My blessed people of God, before we start, before we go to the world of God, let's close our eyes and pray. Amen. Father Almighty, King of kings, Lord of lords, we thank you. We bless your name, Lord, I worship you. I thank you because you are faithful. I thank you because of your love. I thank you because you are wonderful. There is no one like you, Lord. Lord, your word is coming from my Father, my Lord Almighty. The Spirit of the Most High God, Father, I don't know what to say. Holy Spirit, speak to, uh, to me. Oh, Lord, put your word in my mouth. In the name of the Lord Jesus, I cover every family with the precious blood of Jesus Christ. I cover those that want this broadcast later with the blood of Jesus Christ. Thank you, precious Father. Thank you, blessed Redeemer. In Jesus' mighty name, I pray with thanksgiving. Amen. Hallelujah. My people of God, just want to talk about the word of God. God is powerful, God is mighty, and His word is yes and amen. And the word of God is perfect. Hallelujah. We bless God because God is wonderful. God Almighty is a faithful God, He's a lovely Father. I just want to read Matthew chapter 5, verse 44. Let's read together the word of God. Please carry your Bible. I'm with my Bible. He said, But I said unto you, Love your enemy, bless them that curse you. Do good to them that hate you. Hallelujah. You see, this is the word of God. The Lord Jesus Christ, our Father, have came. He said we should bless them that curse us. We should love them that hate us. We should love our enemy. As a children of God, as a believer, as a child of God, when we have come to know Christ, when we have received the Lord Jesus Christ as our Lord, as our personal Savior, we have received salvation. Now, after salvation, we, re we have received certification. As a believer, a true believer that want to go to heaven, the Lord is telling us that we should love our enemy. Though we don't know our enemy, but we should love them. And also pray for them. And those that cause you, Bless them. So you, as a child of God, those are cause you can't cause them, never. But when we're in the world, when you have not no God, yes, you can do that. But now you have no Christ. No, you can't do that. You, those are cause you. Bless them. Say, God bless you today. That is what the Lord wants for us. It has such a believer. I say it has such a by the grace of God. I, I always pray for everyone. Those that do things wrong against me. Those that do things whatsoever. But I pray. Pray for the Father, Lord, have mercy, intervene, deliver them. So God wants us to love the enemy. God wants us to bless those that cost us. God wants us to bless those that have persecuted us. God wants us to live peace with all men. God wants us to show love, the Lord Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. I continue reading. He said, I pray for them which despitefully use you. Hallelujah. And persecute you. So my people of God, the word of God is powerful. Intercession. We are intercession. You need to pray for those that are persecuting you. It can be your marriage, your husband, your children, whosoever they are praying. Jesus is love. God is love. As you are praying for them, they can do what they want to do, but we are praying for them. God Almighty is the one that fought for us. All battles belong to God Almighty, and God is the one that will take revenge, and God knows who to take and who not to take. But as us to make heaven, as the children of God, as a God Almighty children, the chosen one, the covenant children of the Most High God, we need to love our healing. Love those that, love, that, that, cause, that hate you or that cause you. Bless them. Pray for them. It has it for them. One day, God Almighty, we touch them. Continue to pray for them. I know our Father in heaven. We change them. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. God bless you, my people of God, my blessed people of God, in the house of God. Please, let's continue to do well. Let's continue to do good and I continue to love by the grace of God. And I pray for us, receive the power to love in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. I pray for us, receive again the power to love in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. As you, you say amen to this prayer, the power of love will, you will enter you and you will receive it. And you continue to love those that you are, can, cannot love before. And you continue to do what you can never be able to do before. Receive the grace to do mighty things. Receive the grace to please God in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. God bless you all, my people of God. Have a nice day. Shalom. God bless you. Amen.
Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, my father. Bye-bye.